I'm Ryan McDonald for 103.5 The Eagle and 101.9 The Giant. The Eagles were coming off a 6-0 loss to Moncton where they couldn't get anything going, but tonight, everything they touched seemed to go in. Joey Haddad came into the game still in search of his first points of the season, and tonight, he and Chris Culligan both picked up four. Now to the highlights with Kenny McNeil. On the play there by Gilnet. Now back to the point. Nikolev to Malka. He's got a good shot. Fire, save, rebound. He scores! Malka, baby! It's a deep through the five hole. And it's one button. it to Schwerner. Bork has got a bit of a chip on his shoulder here this afternoon. Or they come out. Here's the centering pass. Brodor. Fire score! What a rocket! Up the right point! And Stick Brodor! Right score! And the Eagles lead two nothing. Brodor is second on the air! His hook in his head and was well covered. McNeil down low into the far corner to Slaney. Back up top to Culligan. On and off with Mayer. Off the right circle. Head at first. Shot in the backhand, now to Lavigar. Parked up off that right mid wall. Now to Malk at the point. Fakes the shot to Finn. Finn back to Malka. One timer scores! Malka with a blistering shot there. Maybe hit by McCarran. I'm not sure. But it's a power play goal. And it's 8 2. Get right. But at least. Power plays for the Eagles, far too many. Here's a chance to quickly score. How did that go in? Kelligan might have paced it in off the goaltender Banda. Another weird one. As Chris Kelligan, I think, will get credit for that one. Oh, they're scoring from everywhere. As Kelligan is desperate to with the Jan Piskacek. Here's 
Williams is your route. He front for the rush shot, he scores. He gets a weak one on Olivier Waugh. And it's 9-3. Now Waugh just a little careless there, came off that post. Osara to return feed back to Petit. Down low it goes for Bork. His shot, he scores. Again, Olivier Waugh way down too early. And Bork goes up and over Waugh. And another power play goal. And Olivier Waugh again caught cheating down way, way too early. And Bork manages to put it out of the car. Fed back to the right point to the start. Now to uh, Bork. Bork at a high slot. Here's a shot. There they score. Trudell, another weak goal given up by Olivier Waugh. And it's 9 5. And uh, all of a sudden, this Eagles hockey club has quit playing. 8 54. He'll pitch the puck ahead to Brett McCarron. McCarron through the middle. Here's Paul Ken moving in the breakaway. Shot. Score! Side. He is punished there by Ben. And uh oh, here we go. He just kind of had that feeling that that was going to happen. And Sam Finn is going to toss the, the leather hair with Kaylin Paul. And those two are going to drop the gloves as Finn trying to wrestle Paul up against the bench and trying to get that right hand free. As Paul is tying up Sam Finn right now. That all started as it been with a big hit on Du Hamel. And Caitlin Paul came charging in. Big right hands there by Paul. Finn trying to stay in. And then Finn with a right hand right to the shot. As those players now trading. Right hand. And now they fall to the ice. And uh, Dan Finn. Standing in there against uh, a bigger Kalen Paul, but Ben once again shows that the Heat will step in and go at it with anyone. The car player hurt at the bench. Not sure who that is. 15 seconds left here, and uh, can't really see who the injured points the St. John and Sea Dogs. Here we go with the buck drop to the left of Benda. Brett McCarran, nice job to win it. Back to Slaney. Slaney to Malka, looks off to Robert Slaney on the left point. Back to Malka, the pass behind him now. It is sent there to Joey Haddad. Back up top to Slaney, he waits, fires, tipped in front, rolls just wide. Haddad will touch the puck. And the 